Welcome back to the New Music Alliance Radio Hour. I'm Violet House Thor, joined this week by Mark Ramon. And you just heard I Choose You by Thanks. And starting off that block, we had them paired up with A Little Revolution by Firewater. Uh, this is part of our pairing show where we pair nationally or internationally renowned artists up with some of our local artists. And we hope that if you enjoy the nationally known artists, you're going to like the local one just as much or even more so. So this is an interesting pairing. <laughs> Lots of genre matching here on this one. <laughs> yeah, I, I love Thanks. I, I recently uh, interviewed them. They're, they're a, a three-piece rock trio hailing from Saratoga Springs, but Ben Martin, the drummer, lived in Danbury for a few years and earned a master's degree in jazz studies from the Hart School at University of Hartford. No, oh, there you go. It shows. There's a really in- It's really interesting. It's just three people, apparently, but... They're able to put a lot of work into the studio with a lot of really cool influences. Like, it's not ska, but all of their different influences combined are similar to the influences combined to make ska somehow. They do like to combine a lot. They call their music bars, which is short for blues, alternative, rock, and jazz. Mm, The drums are awesome. The horns are really fun. The lyrics are just fun this this is this is really cool stuff and this is off the album you're welcome which just came out in 2022 i I love the horns on this and uh thanks we'll be performing in the area coming up at the black bear americana music festival the the festival is going to be held in goshen connecticut and going from friday october 6th through sunday the 8th and thanks we'll be performing that saturday on the 7th cool and we had them paired up with Firewater, which I hadn't heard before them. This is this is funky. Obviously oh. a national group, but like, whoa, what what's going on here? They're pretty known um, internationally. In fact, the lead singer, Todd A., is living in, I think, Budapest. Huh. I, I first came across them back in the 90s. They did, were doing a show at UConn and instantly fell in love with them. It's really wild. And they mix a lot together too. Like they call it spy jazz, ska, classic Bollywood, salsa, cabaret, Mexican banda, and even Russian folk. That's yeah, I hear it honestly. It's it's like world music but punk. Mm-hmm. What? Okay, sure. It's, it's it's wild and it's a really good pairing with thanks. I'm glad you like. So, what do we have to wrap up the show, Violet? Y'all know about power metal? No. <laughs> You're about to know about power metal because uh, uh, I listened to power metal a lot back in high school. I loved it so much, especially the first half of this pairing, Dragon Force. If you haven't heard of Dragon Force, then you don't know anything about power metal right off the bat. And <laughs> you're about to experience something brand new. And we have them paired up with a local band, Thunderforge. Uh, so let's start off with Dragon Force and their song, Cry Thunder. <laughs> 